Then we could just move on to Monster's earnings, which I guess it's good news first. We could, yeah. So Hanson Natural, which is obviously the maker of Monster Energy Drink, uh, they were very pleased to report that they had record second quarter earnings. So they saw a profit of about $63.8 million in the second quarter, or $0.69 cents per uh, diluted share. And uh, that profit was an increase of about 11.4% compared to the same uh, second quarter in 2009. Um, and their sales increased about 20.1% to, get this, 415 Point three million dollars in just one quarter. So that was just the three months in the second quarter. Well, and that seems to be to coincide with their their big splashdown in uh, I guess it's Western Russia, <laughs> well, yeah. Western Ukraine. I guess it would be. they've now spread into Slovakia, uh, the Czech Republic. The um, they're also going into the Middle East soon, and uh, they're prepping right now to go into Germany as well. So they're doing a full court press for expansion efforts into foreign markets, uh, especially Europe and the Middle East and so forth. That, that's 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 crazy. And, and I also read in within that that there are people that are saying that they're primed to actually be gobbled up by a bigger company because of their, their uh, I guess, their stock price and everything else. Well, analysts have long said that they would be a valuable acquisition for a distributor, a larger uh, public beverage company to come in, swoop in, and, and take them over. A lot of folks have brought up uh, Coke as being a possibility. Uh -huh. And uh, granted, it's always brought up seemingly every quarter. Um, so this quarter is no different. But yeah, lots of folks like to speculate as to whether or not they could be acquired at some point. Uh, they do have a pretty attractive stock price for those companies. And they do seem to be growing. Their market share, they're basically second to Red Bull in the energy market category that's right. still their their huge leader and i think that's about 80 percent of their business right there is just monster energy brands well, yeah. it, it sounds like they'll probably catch up to them and coke is their distributor is that correct correct yeah right so, now coke is their distributor so it would be, make better sense for coke anyways because that vertical integration they basically kick someone out of the loop and a little bit more profit goes their way well, so, yeah. we'll see